Another way to upload pictures and videos to your Mac from your iOS device is to use AirDrop. So to do this, first go to your camera roll on your iPad and just select the pictures that you want. So I'm going to tap select in the top right corner. I'm going to choose a video, a few pictures, and you'll see that in the bottom right corner of those files I have a blue check mark. And then in order to airdrop these pictures, I first need to go to my Mac and click on Finder. And I'm just going to move this over. And here I see the airdrop button. And in a second, my iPad should pop up. And I'm going to go back to my iPad and I'm going to find this share button here in the top left corner. When I tap on the share button, I'm going to see this airdrop icon. Once you see your MacBook on the airdrop screen of your iPad, you can just tap on it. And over here, you're going to see on your Mac that the download is starting, the upload is starting. And it's basically going to download the pictures and files that I'm sending from my iPad's camera roll. And you can see it's not quite as fast as image capture. That's why if you're doing a lot of videos and pictures, I recommend image capture with that USB cable. And if nothing happens here, basically your files have gone into your downloads folder. So you can see here my images and my videos. So JPEG and .mov files are here. If you ever notice that there's there are no devices showing up in the AirDrop screen, you can tap on this icon or you can sometimes turn AirDrop on and off. We've sometimes had to turn Wi-Fi on and off to get it to show up. Um, just seems to sometimes have a delay, but most of the time it shows up and it works great.